congratulations on becoming the owner of a Hero two wheeler. You will soon discover the joys of owning a Hero scooter and miles of pleasurable riding ahead of you. This film will help you learn basic riding techniques for safe riding. Let's start with the basics. Pre-ride checks. Make simple pre-ride checks before you start your journey. Park the scooter on the main stand. First and foremost, check if you have enough fuel to reach your destination. Engine oil. It is extremely important to check engine oil levels from time to time. If required, add genuine Hero Motocop engine oil and top it up to the appropriate level. Also check for oil leaks around the engine area. Wheels Since the wheel bears tremendous stress and strain, the tyre condition affects the safety and performance of riding such as turning and braking. Check for correct tyre pressure, cuts, foreign objects and tyre wear indicator. Finally, spin the wheel to check for wobbling. Repeat these checks for the rear wheel. Brakes Check the free play and smoothness of the front and rear brake levers. Also inspect the brake shoes for wear and tear. Electricals It is important to check that all the lights are functioning properly. Cap the indicator lights with your hands after turning them on. This helps you to check them in daylight. Similarly, check the tail light with both the front and the rear brake. Check the horn and finally the headlight. Documents and Kits Before you set riding, make sure you have proper documents and kits. These include valid driver's license, registration certificate, insurance papers, PUC certificate, owner's manual, the tool kit and a first aid kit. And don't forget to wipe down your registration plates. So now you have your pre-ride checks done. It takes just two minutes but gives you years of trouble-free riding and enhances the life of your scooter. Riding gear. Riding gear is extremely important for the protection of a two-wheeler rider. Always ride with a helmet properly strapped and insist on a helmet for your pillion rider as well. Your ISI certified helmet should be of an appropriate size and preferably bright in color. A full mask helmet provides better protection. We suggest you're wearing a full sleeve shirt, trouser, leather gloves and shoes while riding. Riding posture. Riding a scooter is enjoyable if you sit in a comfortable posture. Your body posture while riding is also important. Not only does poor posture cause fatigue and discomfort while riding, it also leads to poor scooter handling and poor balance. Here are some tips to help you maintain a good posture while riding your scooter. Sit in a position that gives you easy access to the handlebar and brakes. Look forward in the direction you are moving to cover a wide range of information. Relax your shoulder and bend your arm slightly. Grasp the center of the grips so that you can easily operate the levers and switches. Your feet should rest on the step. Your legs should be comfortable apart, but within the chassis. Be in a slightly leaning forward position. Before riding off, adjust your rear view mirrors and look behind for traffic. Riding on the road. Remember, a hero rider is a role model for others. So here are a few things you should keep in mind at all times while riding. Follow the traffic rules and respect road signs for your safety and that of others. Always ride in your lane and maintain a safe distance from other vehicles. 
Avoid overtaking and if you must overtake, overtake from the right only and avoid weaving through the traffic. Don't cross the continuous line while overtaking. If you're negotiating a roundabout, give way to the traffic on your right and move in a clockwise direction. Always indicate well in time before taking a turn and choose your correct lane in advance. Come to a complete halt before the stop line to let pedestrians cross the road. Do not use the horn at traffic intersections. Follow traffic signals. Never jump amber and red light. Never ride under the influence of alcohol or drugs. Never use your cell phone while riding. Be a courteous and responsible rider. Ride safe the hero way. Braking on the road. Smooth and safe braking is an art form and you can master it in no time. To brake properly, you need to follow these steps. First, decelerate completely. Secondly, apply both brakes together and then gradually increase the force. Third, when you come to a halt, place your left foot firmly on the ground. If you only use the rear brakes, the braking distance increases substantially. Applying only the front brake can cause the front wheel to lock and the scooter to flip over. Balancing The most important aspect of riding a scooter is to maintain one's balance. Your riding posture is crucial on roads. A standing posture helps specially while going on the pothole. Use your elbows and knees to absorb the shock. Keep your weight in both legs. Bend your knees slightly. Lift your hips from the seat, stretch your back, lean slightly forward and look ahead. Cornering The technique for cornering your scooter requires complete mastering of braking, acceleration and balancing. Learning how to open and close the throttle effectively will help you maintain balance. Keep your head perpendicular to the road surface and maintain correct riding posture for better control. Always slow down before entering a curve and accelerate only after completing the turn. Cornering should never be done at high speeds. Now that you're familiar with the pre-ride checks and have learned the right techniques to ride safely, go ahead and put your knowledge into practice. Mm -hmm.